right, verse 7. And when the thousand years are expired, Satan shall be loosed out of his prison. Now, why is Satan being loosed? That is because we are up in the air to be with the Lord. Just like what we read here in, um, well, 1 Corinthians 15 is one place, and then uh, 1 Thessalonians 4 is another place when we are lifted up in the air. Okay, and then we could also go to Matthew 24, Mark 13, or Luke 21, and see that when Jesus comes in the clouds of heaven, we at the last trump, we are gathered together. That means we are lifted up in the air to meet the Lord, all right, with them, caught up together with them. First the dead in Christ shall rise, all right, and then we are changed in a moment in the twinkling of an eye at the last trump, and the dead shall be raised incorruptible, and we shall be changed, all right. So, at the end of the thousand years, when Satan is loosed, why is he loosed? It's because we are up in the air. Just like it was before baby Jesus came along, there was one country or one nation of God, and outside of that country were all the nations deceived by Satan. All right, so Jesus comes along, and he makes the kingdom of God available to whosoever believes in him. Now Satan is bound. He cannot no longer deceive the nations like he did before. And then also also when Jesus returns and we are lifted up in the air to be with him. Now Satan has nothing but unsaved people on the earth. So he, now he's able to go out there and to deceive them once again like he had done before.